Was it a peck again? Was no, it? that was a dry. Even though it was a little one, it was still a dry. Because okay. I went through the ball. Okay. Alright? Even though I only went through the ball touch. Let's see it again then. Alright? Yeah. It's there. I've opened the cue. I've opened the hand. That's my backswing. The elbow stayed yeah. up. Now what's going to shut the hand is the drive. Now I've come through parallel. Look. Yeah. Drop the arm. Look. Okay, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I've drove through. Even though a little one. Now if I want power. Now if I want power, I'll open the hand a bit more. But still drive to yeah. shut the hand. When you open the hand, are you conscious of it, of it, or is it just the... Yeah, the little finger and palm are opening. Yeah. Oh, it's you, another dummy, that is. Yeah. So you, right. you consciously, you, you actually advocate doing that? Yeah. Yeah. On a, on a, on a really s soft shot, it only touches up, it's only, it's only a fraction. Okay. And then on a medium shot, it's a bit more. Mm. And on a big shot, it's even more. You always accelerate through the ball. You never quit. Mm. So what judges the, the power is your back sweep, mm. if that makes sense. Yeah. Right, so I'll take, here's a, bit, here's a full shot now. Opened it, drove. Yeah? Mm, nice line. That's... See, opened it and drove. That's wicked. Didn't come off the line at all. No. So I'm going to explain to you, now you're a driver, so yeah. I haven't got a book. Let's you're going to do it naturally. Let's hope I don't start doing something else. Don't want you pecking, I don't want you pecking. <laughs> right, so you're going to walk in, you put your foot on the line, tip to the ball, aim on the way down, chest to cue. Okay. Now what we're going to do is give you a routine. When your chest hits the cue, we're going to go, we'll try it, two feathers. You ain't going to want no more than that. Okay. They'll be the mat. You might not even want to do two. I don't care if you don't want to do any. Okay. Because you're aiming on the way in, your brain's telling you I'm going to pop the ball so you don't need to keep feathering. Okay. Do you understand that? Yeah. I'll tell you one quick story about this. I'm working with Peter Ebden before the Masters. Okay. Peter's walking in, he's feathering 27 times. Mm -hmm. That's Peter. So I've got okay. him aiming on the way in. Yeah. I get him aiming on the way in, he's only feathering twice. Okay. He plays David Gray, beats him 6 0. Jan Verhaas comes off, pats him on the back and said, what a job you've done on Ebden making him play quick. I didn't try and make him play quick. Mm. I just got him aiming on the way in. And cut out something unnecessary. Yeah, all the waggles. Because if your mm. brain's telling you you're not ready to hit the ball, you're going to keep feathering. So by aiming on the way in, that, that cuts all that out. Mm. Right. So you're going to aim on the way in, foot on line, tip to the ball, aim in chest. Beautiful. Do you cut the waggles? Pause at the you can pause at the front. What's the front pause? Right, I want you to do a front. So get up, you've made a shorter bridge and bent your arm. Okay. So let's get your hand, let's get a shit, let's get a that's too long a bridge. Tip to the ball. Let's get you up to here. Right. Is it the arm is it the arm or is it is it me that's not well getting close? There's two to things, it. you're getting a little bit too close with that. You bend your arm and make and bring the arm back and you've made your arm really smaller, so there's no need. So this, uh, I'll push your this, this is a problem for me. This, it won't be a bridge. problem. It probably, it right, will not. So hang on, let me just wish it short. Yeah. I'm just um yeah. let me show it. I'm just gonna make sure you can see this line. So this is something I could practice. Yeah, I, because just, that's the just, same everywhere you go around the well, world, the dating. That's your dating. Right. It's within a centimetre of that. So don't be no longer than a centimetre of that. <clears throat> so walk in your foot on line and make your bridge up to there. That's it. Up to there. Beautiful. Chest to cue. Yeah? Did I do that right? Well, you feathered. You pulled the cue to the chest yeah. then. Get up again. So get up again. Foot on line. Make your bridge. Tip to the white wall. Beautiful. Chest to cue. Now I've do that. Make time. sure you come in from here. Yeah. Don't come in sneaking yeah. in like a... You come in like an eagle coming in on a rabbit. Yeah. Alright? Mm. So you come in like an eagle coming in on the ramp. So you walk in, your foot goes on the line, come in from above, tip to the ball, aim in, chest to cue. Good. Yeah. Right, now we're going to go one, two, front pause. Okay. Come back and play. Right, right if you get up again, if you get up again, I want to get your bridge up there. Let's get your bridge up Just there. Try shortening the cue. No, don't worry yeah. about shortening that cue. No. I swear to you, you don't need to. Okay. So walk in, foot on line. Tip to the ball, keep your bridge a little bit further, oh, just a little bit. <laughs> sure, look if you want, just yeah. try it, because I'll, I'll make sure you're orthodox anyway. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. Yeah. Now, how do you feel that? Stay there. Now you're perfect. Okay. That is a perfect. You're perfectly there. Now, just to check it, yeah. throw your thumb out and feel yeah. your rib. Yeah. You feel it? Yeah. That's where you want to be. Okay. You don't want to be up there. You don't want to be back here. You want to be there. Okay. You feel that? Yeah. That's your dating. Okay. Now, what I'm going to show you, stay there. Oh, That's all right. Stay there. I know it sounds. What I'm going to show you, I've put this on here now. The back of the hand, the back of the elbow is vertical and I've come down level with your laces. And you should be just leaning into the shot. Your weight should be just slightly towards your toes. Alright. Oh. Oh, yeah, it looks but that's perfect. Now I put tape on that cue there to give you a date and to hold it there every time. Yeah. As long as you add that. Okay. And that's perfect. So what how many inches is that at the front there now? Stay that there now. That's perfect. Stay there. Very hard. <laughs> Alright, I'm only going to. Alright, let go. Okay. I'm just going to put a bit of tape on there. So you grip. So you grip that just behind there, and you're set. So would you say advocate doing that all the time? So if I had a short. You cue, won't need this. You don't yeah. need a short cue. You don't. I, this cue's perfect for you. Yeah. Because if this is your standard cueing, when you have a big bridge, because you're stretching over and you don't want to use the rest, you come to there anyway. Yeah. See, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be happy with yeah, that. Yeah. You're, I have an act to you now. Because you're a driver, if you was a pecker, you would probably have been long. Yeah. I have an act to you. Your, your timing is perfect. I'll tell you that straight away. Your elbow and hand is vertical when you're touching the white ball. It's perfect. That's wicked. Yeah? So I'm going to get that camera and come up here and show you it. Okay. All right. Okay. I want you to grip that just before the tape. I'm going to get the camera. Out. Don't, can I just pick it up? Um, put it on pause. So press the button first. Which one? This um, yeah. Okay. 